What's up, everybody? Uh, Evil here from uh, Sinister Tabletop Gaming. Um, I recently purchased a new 3D printer, and I have a bit of a fleet already, but I've, I've been excited about this one since it came out, which is the CR6 SE. Um, it does auto leaven and all kinds of stuff. I've had it for a few days. It's been printing great. So probably the weak point of this printer is the extruder uh, that everybody complains about. It's meant to be like easy to use, but um, you just can't see what's going on. But this fitting has already given out. Um, there's not a lot of information on the internet about the CR6 yet. Um, there's a user group, but it's, it's just not widespread like the Ender 3. Um, but um, I went through and I, I literally found one post after hours of searching whether you could put um, the regular Mark 8 um, aluminum extruder on this from the Ender 3. So the answer I found is yes, that you can. Um, so I went ahead and I picked one up. Once this print finishes here, I'm going to yank this cheap plastic piece of garbage extruder off here and put the Mark 8, which has been a pretty good, uh, pretty good extruder for the last couple of years for me. All right, and there it is installed um, using the uh, stock gear from the original extruder, which is just like what comes in the Mark 8. And since we're not changing anything there, no need to modify E steps or anything. So this should be plug and play. So let's try it out. My print here that failed earlier was hugely under extruding. You see, it's just falling apart. So hopefully this one holds up better. So we'll do a test print here and see how it goes. All right, so far so good. check back here in a bit all right and there is the final result after the extruder replacement so it wasn't all fun and games um, I replaced the extruder and then promptly had a nozzle clog um, at least I believe that's what it is because when I came back to check on this print <laughs> I found this sticking out of the extruder so that thing had so much bite that with the Bowden clogged, it basically couldn't force any more into the Bowden tube. So it started spindling out like that <laughs> in this big knot. So um, this extruder has tons of grip on the filament. Um, so no issues there with under extrusion, just had the nozzle clog. But uh, you know, once I uh, cleared the clog, um, I finally got a good print and it worked great. So this printer is a, or this extruder is a direct bolt-on for the CR6 SE, and there's your proof that it works great. So if you're having issues with the, the plastic extruder on your CR6, um, the Mark 8's a, a good alternative. So that's it for now, catch you guys later.